Now, once we talked about packages, it's a good time to talk about access modifiers. Now, one of the access modifiers we have seen, in fact, we have seen two, private and public. Apart from this, we have more, we have protected and default as well. So in this video, let's try to explore them or one or two videos. So what I will do is initially I will start with public. Now, what is public basically? Let's go to demo. And we, have, we were trying to import the packages and of course we should do that, right? Anyway, we don't have to do that java.lang, it, it comes already, so we don't have to worry about it. And now what I will do is, I will just go back to my class A. Let's work with class A now. And in this class A, you can see the class A is public, okay? And it belongs to a different package called other. And in this class, I will just create a variable called int, let's say marks. So we have this variable called marks and the let's say initial value for marks is six because we just want to access this, is it working or not? Now, how will you access this variable? So you can just go back to demo. So we have add, we have A, right? Which has this code, which is simple class and then we have a marks. Let me go back to demo and in this, I want to access it. So I will just remove all these lines. Just want to work, in fact, tools is also not I need now, let only work with other. And in this, let me create an object of A. Now, can I create object of A? Yes, we can because we can access it. And then I'm just trying to say obj dot marks. Now that I try to do that, you can see it gives you an error. It says the field A dot marks is not visible. I mean, that's weird. It's there, right? Marks is there. The thing is, it is not public. Now, when it is not public, you cannot access it outside the package. You can see that that's the issue we got. Now, what if you have a class in the same file or maybe in the same package? Uh, let's say in the same package, which, of, which is of demo, I will create a file called b.java. And in b.java, let me just say, because they're in the same package now, so no package is same package basically. I will try to create a variable called int, let's say marks. Now, let's see if I can access this marks in demo. I will just go back here and I will repeat the same sentence, same line in fact two same, same statement with the help of B object now. This is B. The only thing is we have to use a different object name because we cannot have same. And using this OBJ, can I access marks? So you can see there is no issue. Even if marks is not public, it's no issue because they are in the same package. The moment you have a different package and if you don't mention public, it will not work. Okay, that's the issue. You can see it is not working. Now, if you want something to be accessed outside the package, always make it public. And that's why methods, most of the time they are public. Variables should not be public, but methods should be public. Example, if I say public void show here. Now show can show is accessible. I can use show from anywhere. Example, if I can come back here, obj dot show. This will work because that's public. But if I don't write public there, it will not work. Now that's one. So public means it can be accessed from anywhere. Okay. Now apart from public, we also have uh, private. So if I talk about private, can I use private anywhere? Private variable can be used in the same class, irrespective of the package, okay? Package is a secondary part. It can be used in the same pack, uh, same, uh, same class. I can't even use outside the class. Example, let's say, if you look at this B and if you look at this demo, they're in the same package, right? But now, if I create a private variable there, here, if I make this as a private variable, which you, sh which you should always mark your variables as private. The moment you make it private, even if they're the same package, you can't access it. So private variables can be used in the same class, irrespective of the package. It's on the same class. Now let, let me reiterate. When you talk about public, it can be used from anywhere. Okay, you can see this table. Uh, public can be used from anywhere. Private can be used from the same class. Okay. Now, apart from public and private, we have two more. Okay, let's talk about those now. Now, if you talk about this A, if you don't mention private, something should be applicable, right? If it is not private, it is not public, what is it? So by default, there is something called a default access modifier, okay? Which is also called private protected, but we'll talk about that later. But it is called default. Now, default simply means it can be accessed in the same package. It's as simple as that. It, is, it can be accessed in the same package. Example, if you talk about this B, when private was not there, it was able to be accessed in the same package. So we got private, which can be accessed in the same class. We got public, which can be accessed from anywhere. And then we got private, which can only be accessed in the same class and default in the same package. Okay. Apart from this, we have one more. 
which is called protected. Now, what is protected? Now, let's say we have this class A, which has, let's say if I make this variable as protected, okay? And then I'm going back to demo and inside this demo somewhere I'm creating a class in the same package, basically, they, it doesn't have to be in the same class or same file in a different package, basically. Let me create class called C and then I'm saying that this class extends A. Now in this class A, so you can see this is protected. Uh, can I use protected in some other package? You can see marks is protected in the other package like demo. Again, marks is not working. So basically, if you make it protected, you can't use it outside the package. Before coming there, in fact, you know what, what we should do? Let's try to create a class here itself. Let's say a class called launch. And in this class, let me have a method which is public void ABC, let's say. And let me try to create object of A equal to new A. And see from here, can I try, if I try to use marks, let me just print marks, obj dot marks. Okay, it is working. So it works in the same package, but it doesn't work in other packages. Okay, so you can see demo is another package. But what about a subclass? We have class C here. And then if I try to create a method public void ABC, and you can see this class C looks same in both the packages. The difference is this is a different package and it is extending A now. And now if I try to access marks, it works, there's no issue. You cannot uh, access marks outside the package, but you can access marks outside the package, but it should be a subclass. If you can see, C is a subclass of A. Now, if you see this image here, this is how the image looks like, right? Let's talk about private. Private can be used in the same class, no one else. Protected can be used in the same class, in the same package, in the other package, but subclass. Public can be used everywhere. Default can be used in the same package. Okay, it's, it's that simple. So this is how you specify the modifiers. Now, how do we use and which one to use? Basically, the idea is very simple. Try to make your classes public, which we are doing. And of course, we don't have a public here. The thing is, you can't even make this class public because you cannot have two public classes in the same, fo same file. But, and the general idea is in one file, you should have only one class. So try to make your class public. Next, try to keep your variables, the instance variables private. The methods most of the time will be public. But if you think there is a method or a variable which should be accessed only in the subclass of other packages, use predicted. Try to avoid default. Default is not something we should be using. I know from, from if you check all this thing, we are promoting default a lot, but don't do that. Don't use default stuff. Example, this is default. Either make it private, public, predicted or public. Don't keep it default. Default simply means you don't know what to give the access. So keep it private, predicted or public.